Hey guys, it's your girl Vanessa here. Welcome back to another video. Are you currently looking for a go-to high growth oil that you can stick to and see results for thicker hair, longer and healthier hair in general? You have definitely come to the right place. I'm going to share with you a really simple high growth oil recipe that will help you achieve just that. So if you are interested, definitely be sure to keep on watching. Now before we get into the video guys, I just want to say a huge thank you to all my new subscribers thank you so much for joining the family and for all of you guys that are returning i'm super grateful to have you all thank you so much for your love and your support and yeah i really appreciate appreciate you um so let's hop right into the video the first ingredient we're going to need guys is my all-time favorite aloe vera if you've been working with me for a long time you will know that i love aloe vera and a lot of people have used it and definitely i um, seen amazing results i've used aloe vera on my hair for so many years and it's always been good to me um so i would suggest that you try and find this if you don't um have it in your area it's okay to check amazon you might be able to get one of those that you can you know just water in the house and it can grow um as well now for today's recipe it's quite important that you have these guys um because aloe vera gel from the store will not do do it for today's recipe so you just cut your aloe vera essentially give it a good wash and then we're just going to cut it into smaller pieces just like you can see me do here aloe vera is super good because it helps it helps to strengthen the hair it helps with an itchy scalp it promotes hair growth it also controls greasy hair which sometimes can lead to dandruff which is the ma major cause of um, hair thinning and hair loss so aloe vera is super super beneficial for our hair in and scalp in general now this is what our aloe vera looks like after it's been cut into smaller pieces so i'm just going to go ahead and pop my stove on medium heat and essentially um, just place a pot on there and I'm going to add some rapeseed oil and also just a little bit of coconut oil now I didn't I realized that I was not recording um, when I added the coconut oil guys but I use one tablespoon of coconut oil and for the rapeseed, rapeseed oil um, basically I'm just I'm just eyeballing it but you can use as much or as little as you want so essentially um, once you've done that guys just pop your aloe vera in there and then we're now going to go ahead with our next ingredient which will be some ground coffee um, I'm using ground coffee powder but it's okay to use any other coffee that you may have available I prefer this one because it's really strong and it's quite high in caffeine which is the major act acting agent when it comes to um, to high growth when it comes to coffee essentially now if you're in the UK I get this from Morrison's because I did get quite a few questions in my previous video with regards to where to get this coffee from but you can also check Amazon you might be able to find it on there so I added one tablespoon of coffee now I'm going in next with some rosemary um, rosemary again it's super super beneficial when it comes to um, to high growth because it helps to improve scalp circulation and it can be used to grow longer hair prevent baldness and stimulate new high growth in balding areas so rosemary oil also shows um, that it, it, it helps with stopping um, grey hair and also preventing uh, dandruff so super amazing so you just need to stir that for about two to three minutes guys after that's done you just want to take it off the stove and this is what it looks like so we're going to go ahead and strain this so for this I'm using um, wig cap um, but feel free to use any other thing you may have available a coffee filter will do absolutely fine for this as well when we wake Hear the birds and see the sun Side by side our fears are done All the good times just begun Oh, we know what we have, let's hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life 
call us crazy But things are finally right With you and I the future is bright Okay guys, so after straining, this is what the oil looks like and this is super super potent and it will help you a lot when it comes to regrowing bald areas, preventing baldness, and thickening your hair and essentially just helping with general hair growth. So it is a super amazing oil and I do hope that you guys go ahead and give it a try. So I will be putting this into an applicator bottle so that it's easier for me to apply to my hair. And also I can store this um, in a house for a pretty long time because it's got really minimal water content in it um, so now some of you guys actually get confused um, with me sharing like different recipes on here I just thought I will address this pretty quickly before we move on to the next part of the video so essentially obviously my channel is about hair growth and maintenance and basically just DIY hair growth recipes and I know this really confuses some of you guys when I come on here and I share different recipes with you guys every single week um, you know saying that this will help that will help and so on and so forth the reality is that they all work and I have put some of those recipes to the test for you guys I've done some challenges um, in the past, I think I probably have one on my channel, a pretty recent one. Um, so you can actually see that it actually works and most people who have gone ahead and tried this have come back with amazing testimonies that is definitely helped their hair. Now I completely understand where the confusion comes from because obviously you probably just want me to share one thing and then um, maybe just use it and see and show you guys what the results are. Um, but like I said, this is a DIY Hager channel, so I'm bringing you guys recipes that do help when it comes to um, hair growth and maintenance in general. And these are the things that I have certainly tried on my hair, and I've also got family and friends that have tried them and certainly are seeing results. Now, it doesn't necessarily mean that you have to go ahead and try every single one of them. Um, you can just pick and choose whatever floats your boat essentially and just go ahead and just use that as your staple if you want. The thing about this is that you have to be consistent to be able to see results. So I'm not saying go ahead and try every single one of them every single week. Um, it's just for you. It's, I'm just giving you guys ideas really so you can just you know see what recipe you want to try. Because when I show you these recipes guys, I tell you about each benefits of each ingredient that goes into the recipe. So you can certainly um, just, just pick whatever you want to try based on what issue you may have with your hair. And just be consistent with it and then see results and then move on. Um, so I hope that this kind of clears the confusion because I feel like... It's difficult to go ahead and just answer every single person that leaves this comment because I do get this comment quite a lot. Now back to the video, the way that you would use this oil um, will clearly just depend on your own preference but I would suggest that you follow these instructions um, just because that's how you will get to see the results. Um, so there are two ways in which you can use this. You can use it as a hike of oil by just simply applying it to your scalp or those areas that you do struggle um, with. So perhaps if you've got bald patches or your hair is thinning in certain areas or just looking to just grow your hair all together, then apply to your scalp generously and then just give it a good massage. Now scalp massages, I always talk about it guys, it's super important when it comes to improving um, blood flow to the scalp area and also helping with stimulating hair growth so you can use this once every week or twice every week it really just depends on you or more if you want to just depends on how well your hair or your scalp retains oil um, over time now you can also use this as the pre treatment 
which is one that you do before you shampoo your hair and that will help you not only like in stimulating hair growth but also retain moisture in your hair after you go ahead and shampoo it um, so I hope that this video was somewhat um, helpful to you guys and if you did find it helpful and you liked the video please go ahead and give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're not already I would really really appreciate it and I would love to have you around as well also leave me a comment if you are confused about something or you want clarification on something or if you have a question anything like that I do read the comments and I will answer them as soon as I can and then yeah I'll catch you guys in my next video bye